What's up, everybody? Welcome to my channel. It's your boy Dio coming at you guys with another review. Today, we're gonna to be looking at the Jordan Times Travis Scott shorts. Let's get into it. If you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. It helps the channel out so much. Now, I'm going to start off with saying these are super dope, a really unique pair of shorts. Um, these, are, I believe, are one of the first collabs that Jordan and Travis Scott had um, clothing-wise. These are just insane, if you guys can see the print on them. Definitely something really nice to get my hands on. It's the shorts that I, I owned these like a while ago when they uh, like first came out. And I ended up getting rid of them. I kind of wish I didn't. Uh, these are on a double XL. I had them in an XL. Preferably wish I had them in an XL again. So I would definitely recommend going true to size. This is something you don't really see that often. And they have like this kind of like pre-fade look on them, which looks really dope. One thing about my old ones is this lettering crack. So you gotta be really careful when you watch these. You have to watch them inside out and uh, definitely let them air dry. This is something that I would probably not wear that much, honestly, because they're already faded. And then this print is like bound to crack. As you guys can see, there's so many crazy details. You're gonna see a cactus jag. You're gonna see flames. You're gonna see the smoke. And then you're gonna see the air right here. And then also on the bottom, you have like a very big, but it's like kind of cut off swoosh right here, which looks super unique. And then on the other side right here, you're gonna see a flame basketball, which is a cool, it's a cool design, but I, I don't know what that exactly is saying. I know this is flight right here. I see the flames again, then I see 23. So if anyone knows the, the drawing on the, on the top, maybe I'm looking at it wrong. Oh, damn, I feel dumb. It's definitely on the side right here. It's Jordan. And I was looking at it at the wrong angle. So yeah, it has flight 23, Jordan, and then you also are gonna have a jump man on the bottom right here. Let me show you guys. These actually aren't, like too expensive. I think they're online for like 140, um, $160, which isn't too bad for this collab. And I think these are super sick. They aren't made out of like any Nike lab or anything. These are a Jordan collab because they have like the Jordan tag, which is like actually a pretty big difference in some of the material and like quality of the stuff that they make. Um, I don't know why they do that, but some of the collabs that Travis Scott has done has been with Nike and they'll have Nike lab ones and some of them with Jordan just kind of depends and sometimes they just let uh travis scott throw the nike swoosh on his stuff so it's like three different types of quality and materials which is really interesting that they do that um one thing that's really cool uh that they throw a pretty unique pocket on the back it's like an old school i feel like you don't really see these like style pockets even though i don't use back pockets but uh, it's kind of unique and kind of cool just a little back pocket um covers up there's no button or anything like that and the pockets are actually pretty pretty deep in big sizes they come with one on this side and you're gonna have one on the other side as well and that's pretty much it on the shorts um let me know what you guys are thinking uh if you guys like these shorts or if you guys own these shorts i know a lot of people probably haven't seen some of this stuff so it's kind of cool to show you guys and like i said i will drop the product number in the description i said in every video just so you guys are able to find it um use that product number search it up and you'll be able to find what this exactly is i'll probably give you guys a StockX link so you guys are able to just buy it straight from there i personally don't purchase from StockX. i just do that for you guys so you guys are able to find it and if you do purchase off StockX and you feel more comfortable because there's a lot of fakes going around um, a lot of the stuff that i'm showing you guys and it's kind of hard to tell what's real and fake if you're not someone that really buys a bunch of this stuff all the time Whereas even for me, some of the stuff I've looked at, I'm like, oh yeah, that's, that's fake. And I didn't even realize looking off the pictures, um, I've gotten a couple items in where I've had to send them back. So like I said, I'm gonna drop the StockX link for you guys. And then I'll also drop the product number and you should be able to find the product number in the StockX link, but I'll make it a little easier for you guys. So hope you guys are really enjoying the channel. Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe. It helps the channel out so much. And uh, let me know what you guys are thinking of the content and let me know what you guys think of the shorts. Thank you guys for watching. I'm out.